What's up YouTube, it's Jesse with Glass Trigger. Today we're gonna to dive into the top three cartridges to get started on your long range journey. If you're interested in getting into some serious long range marksmanship and you're trying to find the perfect round to start learning, train, or even compete with, this video is for you. Before we dive in, please hit that subscribe button. That way you can be sure you won't ever miss any surprise puppy appearances. How did we select these cartridges? For a cartridge to be long range beginner friendly, it needs a couple things. One, availability. You need to be able to easily find good match grade ammunition. If you're not using the same ammunition each time, you're going to have to repeatedly test and build data, which can be a time intensive process. If you've ever played hide and seek with a toddler, that's about how difficult it should be to find your ammo. Two, cost. If it's affordable, you're more likely to actually shoot it. There's some high quality factory ammunition out there at reasonable prices. Reloading your own can increase your availability and quality and may decrease cost, but I'm going to assume beginners won't be reloading since it's an entirely other time intensive skill. Three, Low recoil. This is an important point and it isn't just for beginners. Long range cartridges need to have lower recoil because it allows us to see our hits, misses, and sometimes our bullet trays. There are edge cases for extremely long distances in certain situations, but for the vast majority of long range shooting, you want a low recoil cartridge. Four, ballistics. Our cartridge needs to be able to consistently perform at long distances. I'll break down some ballistic data on these cartridges and even give you some ammunition recommendations. At number three, we have a long range underdog, the 223 Remington. It may be surprising, but the 223 can effectively engage targets to about 800 yards. While it doesn't carry the energy necessary for long range hunting, ballistically it's quite capable of reaching some serious distances. There's a wide selection of affordable, easy to find long range capable ammunition. I've personally had great success with RUAG Swiss P Target 69 grain and Federal Gold Medal Match 77 grain. For each cartridge, I've given you some basic info. The ballistic coefficient has been tested and will not match the BC listed on the box. I've also included bullet drop, velocity, energy, and wind drift at 200 yard increments. Bullet drop is based on a 100 yard zero and wind drift is based on a 10 mile per hour 9 o'clock crosswind. Up at number two, we have a cartridge that has been turning off birthdays for over 70 years, the 308 Winchester. It might not be the sexiest cartridge you've ever seen, but it boasts an incredible range of abilities that have made this grandpa apparently unkillable. This ammo is everywhere, and you can find a ton of match grade stuff for decent prices. I recommend trying out Federal Gold Medal Match 175 grain or Hornady Match Boat Tail Hollow Point 178 grain. The 308 experiences approximately 10% less bullet drop than the 223 at 800 yards, but experiences almost 50% less wind drift. The 308 also maintains 1,000 foot pounds of energy at 600 yards. If the 308 isn't sexy enough for you, it comes with the added benefit of being easily upgradable. For many cartridges, upgrading would require at a minimum a bolt face swap and a barrel swap. The 308 fortunately shares a bolt face and action length with a couple different cartridges and likely only requires a barrel swap and minor tweaking to convert. Here's a couple of those cartridges that are easy to convert to. If you look at this graph of the most used cartridges in the Precision Rifle series, you'll notice that nine of the top 10 most used cartridges fit into this category. Before we get to number one, I had an honorable mention that didn't make this top list, the 22 Long Rifle. I wanted to mention the Modest 22 because of what a great training tool it is. It can be difficult to find long range targets and the 22 allows us to start learning about bullet trajectories, wind drift, and other long range techniques at only 150 to 300 yards. You can find this ammo everywhere as well for less than a dime a round. It may not have the ballistics of our top three with an effective target range of about 300 yards, but it's an incredibly fun and useful round to have in your gun safe. While the 308 and 223 might be underdogs, I'm sure this number one pick will surprise no one. The 6.5 Creedmoor, or as some like to call it, the 6.5 Needmore. 
The Creedmoor boasts great long-range ballistics with an effective range of up to 1,200 yards with factory ammo. Ammo is still relatively available and the cartridge is well established, especially with SOCOM adopting it as a sniper cartridge. For ammunition, I've had great success with Hornady Match ELDM 140 grain or Norma Golden Target 143 grain. The Creedmoor has significantly higher BCs than the others. This allows it, despite having lighter bullets, to maintain 308 levels of energy at various distances. It also experiences anywhere from 15 to 30% less wind drift over the 308. I know some of you are going to disagree with this list, so please let me know in the comments how I got it wrong. I also realize some of you would prefer to be shot by a Creedmoor before shooting one yourself. It's my opinion that all these cartridges make especially good introductions into long range shooting because they are widely available, affordable, have great training value, and solid long range capabilities. Sure, there are potentially sexier rounds that pop up and disappear all the time, but with these three, you can be confident they'll be sticking around. If you want to see more or just help a new YouTuber out, please like and subscribe. If you have any other questions or comments, please let me know in the comment section down below. Good luck out there and may your groups be small.